at the class track. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to cowboy up here in Hobstadt. Good start right there. Justin Grant tries to work right up through the middle. Kevin Thomas Jr. able to use that outside line to show the way to his friend and former mechanic, Jason McDougal. McDougal slots back to third. KT leads lap number one. Justin Grant moving up to that second spot after taking car number four from position number four. Farther on back, it's a log jam. Fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. Justin Grant around KT for the race lead here at the end of lap number two. Grant looks stout early on in these 30 laps. Fight Grant being thick in lap traffic. Brady Bacon has caught up to the tail tank, that bright orange tail tank of Logan Seavey. Remember, if Seavey finishes inside the top 10, Brady Bacon or KTJ, either one of them, need to finish in front of Seavey by four spots. Speaking of four, there's Justin Grant. We're past the halfway point, 13 laps this time by. Boy, Brady Bacon trying to wear out Logan Seavey. Bacon with a good run out of four, but his momentum's going to be stalled. Yellow flag waves. Trouble in the middle of turns three and four. That's Cole Bodine, and boy, uh, a bad night for him in Hopstadt, Indiana. Continues with another spin over in three and four. On the exit of turn number four, Chase Stockton almost have the outside line coming down the front straightaway. Cummins and Stockton fight for the third and final spot on the podium. Where is Indiana Sprint League point leader Logan Seavey? 13th position, last time by. They come across the start finish line. Seavey remains 13th in the running order. Up front, Justin Grant. Nobody's had anything for him all night long. The lead grows from eight-tenths of a second to 1.1. We get close to five to go. They'll see the open hand of our chief starter, letting Grant know five laps to go as they come across the start-finish line. There it is, five laps. Kevin Thomas Jr. runs right now in that second spot, needing to beat Logan Seavey by four positions. This could turn to Kevin Thomas Jr.'s fortune in just a few laps. Kevin Thomas Jr. picked up the Indiana Sprint Week title back in 2017. Chase Stockett has found his way right next to the 3R of Kyle Cummins. They battle tooth and nail here for that third position. Two laps left as they come across the start-finish line. Justin Grant looks good. Kevin Thomas Jr. looks even uh, stronger as he runs right there in second spot. Boy, Kyle Cummins missed the bottom right there, climbed up over the berm at the entry to turn number one. The white flag waves for Justin Grant in that NOS Energy drink number four. He searches for his fifth feature victory in 2021. And right behind him, KTJ. Grant's going to win the battle, but KT wins the war. Kevin Thomas Jr. is your 2021 Indiana Sprint Week champion.